Hi, welcome to another Fusion video. I'm Jennifer Gianni and this is Casey. And today we're going to be looking at something that we call Body Braille. It's a course that we have in our Fusion Intensive. Um, and we also kind of break apart exercises like this when you take our teacher training modules. So it's just looking at the exercise a little bit deeper, looking at the alignment, and finding creative ways to help the clients stabilize and find the right action. So we're just going to be doing a very simple supine leg slide. And you can see I have a little slidey towel under her foot. You could also, for more challenge, use the Mikasa ball under the foot. A little bit more proprioceptive challenge with that Mikasa ball. Or you could use a big stability ball also, which changes the exercise depending on what you're going to use. So from here, I'm going to ask Casey to find all her neutral anchors, right? And so I'm just going to watch her move for a moment. So on your inhale, go ahead and slide that leg out into the distance, and she can dorsiflex the foot at the end of her move. Good. And then on the exhale, slowly drag it back in. And to really get a good picture of this, right, in real life, I would be walking all the way around her. And actually, I'm going to walk behind her, um, behind her head and see her do another slide. Deep inhale. Good. And on the exhale, coming back in. Great. So Casey's a wonderful mover, but what we're seeing just a little bit here is that she's spilling her energy a little bit um, off of this hip. So what I can do is I can cue her to find a little bit more heaviness on this left side, cueing her to find a little bit more inner thigh on this left side, and even imagining that this left inner thigh could travel to diagonal to this opposite shoulder. So she has this kind of tension line here from the inner thigh to the shoulder. So let's find that first. And this, you know, if you're on the mat, you don't have the equipment to help you, this is a good cue to use. Mm -hmm. So on the inhale, you're going to slide the leg out, reaching out through the heel. Good. So this cue is helping her to suction this leg deeper into the hip socket. And then on the exhale, I want you to still feel that diagonal tension connection as she comes back in, which is actually harder to hold on to sometimes than the way out. It feels different. Good. Mm -hmm. Now, another little tool that you can use if you happen to be on the Cadillac is we're going to add the bungee cord to the stable leg. So place the foot down. And this is really going to help her to integrate both her inner thighs, right, keeping this leg stable so she's not spilling out on this hip. So let's try this again. Inhale. And I want her to keep thinking about that diagonal connection, slurping the leg deeper and deeper into the hip socket. Good. And then on the exhale, drawing it back in. Great. Do one more for me, and I just want you to get a little bit longer in this side. Good. And inhale out, inner thigh to that opposite shoulder. Beautiful. Good. And I want her feeling equal weight on each side and gently coming in. Good. Keeping that length through the back of the body, sliding it in. Great. Very nice. How did that feel? It was good. Um, yeah. This was actually really, really helpful for me to get that whole stabilizing side because that feedback just got me thinking about that length and helping me kind of Good. Yeah. Things. It helps her pull herself apart a little bit mm -hmm. more. And it, it gives her the message of what she has to do without this. Yes. All right. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you again soon. Bye. Bye.